Guys, we're surrounded by trucks here. There's a huge line of them coming in. Doctor, what exactly are they bringing in? So typically we're bringing in three different debris streams. We're bringing in recyclable metal, recyclable concrete, which has been tested before it's been recycled, as well as vegetative debris. The 20 ton three axle trucks that you typically see are the concrete and uh, metal. And then uh, the vegetation is usually with a knuckle boom self-loading truck. So we have about 129 debris crews operating as we speak. That crew is made up of a, an excavator, a skid steer, and then usually three trucks. Uh, with the higher throughput, we can have more trucks on each crew. So they're clearing each property in maybe a day to a day and a half. After each truck is individually weighed at a scale, the material is unloaded. Here's where the clean concrete goes. A fleet of excavators with jackhammers, clamshells, and other attachments demolish the concrete slabs into smaller pieces. A special excavator with a powerful magnet hovers above, pulling any metal, like rebar, out of the concrete. A dedicated hose crew waters the debris to keep the dust down a critical safety measure that keeps workers and the surrounding community safe, while air quality monitors track the dust to ensure compliance with local air quality standards. How exactly does that magnet work to remove the, the rebar and other metal? So uh, it's got a switch mechanism inside. So as he hovers over anything that he thinks might be metal, he turns it on. It's a pretty powerful magnet. It'll pick up that metal, including any incidental concrete that's still attached. He'll swing it over to his pile that he's making, turn the switch off, and then it'll drop. Different attachments to our excavators. One is a, a clamshell that'll, that'll essentially take that big piece and make it into a smaller one. The other one is the hammer. And then that gets essentially pushed over into a certain pile. And then the loader, which you can see behind us, is taking those smaller chunked up pieces and then putting it, inserting it right into the grinder. 